Martina Devlin explains how she came by the inspiration for her historical novel, The House Where It Happened. The House Where It Happened is a novel, but it's based on a true story. We know what happened because there was a court case around it and there are 300-year-old court documents which tell the story. In 1711, a young woman, aged 18, Ulster Scots, named Mary Dunbar, arrived to stay with relatives in Island McGee. That's in quite a remote part of Ireland, on the northeast coast in Antrim. Almost immediately, Mary Dunbar underwent a change. She claimed she was being attacked and persecuted by witches, and she named eight local women as the witches. One after another, these women were carted off to prison and put on trial. It must have been a sensational court case. People came from far and wide for the witches' trial. It was a mass trial. There had been nothing like it in Ireland before. And the women were found guilty of witchcraft. Just a few years later, witchcraft was taken off the statute books. Now, why did this happen? There was almost a kind of witch fever going on in Antrim at the time. Nobody really knows what went on, but I try and provide some answers.